We've chosen a spot in the back garden. I'm fortunate enough to have this lovely lawn. Essentially, you want to, you know, make the most of the space that you've got. Touch on the elements we discussed earlier in terms of getting the most sunlight, having access to water. Now we're ready to actually start to create our veggie patch. And the simple, easiest way to do that, actually do a process called double digging. Essentially, it's called hard work. But it is just breaking up this soil. So we're trying to aerate the soil in order for the plant's roots to get down. Particularly if you've got compacted soil, it's worth aerating it to begin with. You could do a no-dig garden style on top, which I'll explain in another lesson. But this is the quickest, easiest way. And you know, pretty much after digging this up, which will probably take me maybe half an hour to an hour, I'll have this area space ready to actually start growing food. A couple tips for you post hole shovel, um, worth spending the money and getting a good quality one. And how you tell that is that it's got a nice weight to it, which actually makes the whole process of getting underneath the turf a hell of a lot easier because it's nicely balanced. Now essentially the process is just removing, so I'm gonna remove the turf to begin with. I'm gonna set that aside in my compost. And then I'm going to actually create a trench along the width of the, the garden bed. I'm going to take that soil, put it in the wheelbarrow, the first shovel leg. So basically I'm going to go down about 20, maybe 30 centimetres. And then I'm going to have a trench. So then at about 20, 30 centimetres deep, I'm then going to turn over that soil below that. And I'm going to work my way back. So I'm going to then grab the top 20, 30 centimetres and put that into the trench in front loosen up that soil below and then repeat the process until I've done the whole garden bed. Okay, another tip for you. All right, if you want to get a nice level um, garden bed, use the back of the rake rather than the front of the rake, just run it over the top. With the back of the rake, you'll get a nice level. There you have it, there's my little lesson on double digging. So I'm ready to start planting if I wish.